Hello, Fernando Mendez from Stockholm at the Eurovision Song Contest 2016 with JP at the camera. And today we have a very special treat. We come with a double return to the contest. We have the country coming back after an absence, and we have the artist coming back after a few years without letting us see her. Here's Poli Genova for Bulgaria. Hola! <laughs> Hello, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too, Polly, finally, after all these years. <laughs> so, as I was saying, double return for Bulgaria after uh, some time without coming to the Eurovision Song Contest and you have been uh, the chosen one to represent the country. Uh, does that add some pressure to this uh, entry? Yeah, of course, but uh, somehow I'm experienced enough to know which uh, which is important, which is not so much. So um, I have, I know that I have just have to focus on my um, on my performance and just to enjoy the moment. So everything it will goes away. Excellent. Uh, well, since you were already at the Eurovision Song Contest in 2011 with Nainat, uh, how much, uh, how did that experience teach you, and how is that helping you this year in Stockholm? Oh, it teaches me a lot. It 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 teaches me um, how to react, how um, how to 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 be confident on the stage, how to calm down, how to be uh, very focused, uh, how to how to um, collect the energy and gave it to the people. And there is a lot of energy here. I can <laughs> notice that. Oh, yay! Oh <laughs> uh, well, the song "If Love Was a Crime." Mm -hmm. Well. Which crime would that be? Every crime. <laughs> it will be. It, you know, it's, it's a great metaphor to know that uh, love can conquer everything. Love is in the light, is in our hearts. So uh, we, we can do everything we want. We can conquer everything uh, in the name of love. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Sweet. And, uh, well, continuing with your story, with your career, I have read in your biography that you studied filming and uh, directing. Yes. <laughs> Is that still ongoing? Have you completed those studies? Actually, it's still no, because I, I don't have enough time to make my um, uh, projects, uh, final projects, because, you know, I have to uh, uh, graduate with um, a, a big, uh, big things like a f maybe documentary film or um, some action, we will see. But I have to have time to um, make a script, to uh, gather a team. But this will happen, and it's cool because you know, for 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 the for directing, as much as you have experience, as much you're you're getting better with the, every moment, with every memory that you have, every experience that you have. This is very important because you collect it, collect it, collect it, and then in the end, you have stories to tell, you have memories to to uh, to put it in the story. So it's it's very important. The, the experience is very important, and I know that one day. Um, I will do that. Excellent. And I'm, I'm curious. I saw your music video and there was a little bit of a director. You were like a director watching a project. <laughs> is that the case? <laughs> um, uh, maybe. Uh, actually, this is the, the preview of the video. We didn't have enough time to make the official video. So hopefully that will happen um, right away uh, after Eurovision. Because the song, it's worth it. It's, it's, a, it's a great song. And uh, I, actually, the the lots of the the biggest um, music TVs in Europe wants it, wants to play it all the time. So uh, even for heavy rotation. So we need, I need to make a very good video. So now I'm collecting ideas. If if you have some of these, tell me. Yeah, that's that's a good point. I can give you some. I will try. Okay. Oh, <laughs> uh, Polly, one of the one other side of you is your charity campaigns. We know that you are involved with yeah. some of uh, um, social awareness uh, to help the weakest. Mm -hmm. Tell us a little more about that. Uh, sorry. Tell us a little more about that. Uh, how do you get involved in that uh, activity? Well, uh, it, you know, Bulgaria is a very small country, and. Um, our government and our uh, economics are not so strong and we're not so powerful and we don't have enough um, uh, finances to to uh, to help all of the people who need who need that so um, me as uh, as a popular uh, person um, a popular name in Bulgaria it's a responsibility to help everyone 
who need me in, in every way. Uh, it doesn't matter if it's a concert or if it's a video or if it's a hosting or if it's or if it's just to go to the kids and to uh, just to make them feel better. For example, because uh, one of the campaigns that I'm working in is the uh, the kids who have uh, cancer in Bulgaria. Um, so it's very important to me to sometimes to, to just to see them, to go to them, to talk to them, just to to know that they're not they're like like all the others it doesn't matter they had some some disease that, that doesn't matter they have to feel uh, a complete person so it's it's important for me you know because f for me uh, the popularity it's all about that to help the mm -hmm. others not just to blah blah and to be on the spotlights on th that's that's not the point you have to um, you have to make something that t to stays after you because you know the life is so short excellent that's brilliant lovely words so well Polly, we're gonna wrap up here thank you Polly. best of luck thank you very much and we'll see you around here yes you're welcome thank you thank you